your Jack attention, please. Ryan gets the call now from the pen to take Kansas over City. on the mound and start Number the home 30. seventh. Yeah. Ryan. Now with the plate, Max Kepler. And if you remember, I'm sure he does, he hit a round tripper back in the fourth. Leading off for the twin. Fouled away. The right fielder, Max Kepler. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Behind 0-2 now. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. So a good job to get the out there, but with five runs already surrendered, that's not going to do any favors to the team ERA so far this season. And that's now not that all that promising a number as they find themselves just Tyler one spot eight. off the bottom in off the American day. League. Strike one to start the at-bat. The windup and the 0-1. And he fouls this one off. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Hit down the third baseline. But a foul ball, and the count holds at 0 2. The 0 2 once more. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And this will wind up being nothing more than a long foul ball, and it'll hold the count at 0 2. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back to back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. No problems for him on the mound since he's come out of the pen to start this inning. That's back to back K's and he's making it look pretty easy. This has the makings of a good outing the so far. Number nine. First Your pitch stop. on its way. way. And he'll good just get a piece ahead. here as this is chopped foul at home plate. 5 2 our score as we play inning number seven. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. Wow, that changeup is an absolute beaut. They call it the great equalizer for a reason. Now a fastball as he just reared up and let that one fly, and the inning is over. Twins are set down one, two, three. They're still out. Here's Carlos Santana now. Leading He'll get things started now in the bottom of inning number eight. Carlos. eight bottom nine, part of the zone, off. a good changeup gets the call. With this one almost in the books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Yeah, you ain't kidding, Matty. Dan, what does this feel like when balls are just flying out of the yard? Dero, it's just one of those days when you're out there as a pitcher going, Oh, I wish I was somewhere anywhere else but on that bump right now. This has the makings of being a long game. And this is hit hard to the right side. Foul. Another 0-2 coming. Still no balls and two strikes. The next 0-2. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Eaton is under this one. One down. And now back to the leadoff spot in the Twins lineup. Now Stepping in, Byron Buxton. He singled his last time up. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 1. Yeah, you attack the zone and get a swing and a miss that late on your first pitch fastball. Good chance he's coming right back with the same thing into the corner and slicing foul. All right, that's when you got to tell yourself to slow down a little bit right there. Out in front on a fastball, hit it hard, but pulled it foul. Grounded up the first baseline. O'Hearn scoops it up, it. and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Striding forward now is the DH, Jorge Polanco. So far, two for Four three bags. in this one. Ball and a high ball. strike there, 0-1. Two outs, nobody on, but a base runner here feels like it would really change the complexion of the inning. Yeah, Matt, that's a great point. If this two-hitter finds a way on, it really sets up. Well, the play's been made, and that retires the side. Down go the Twins in order, and it remains 5-2. to two.